Welcome to Attorney of Fact Files. In this series, we'll take a look at some of the questions regarding He-Man and She-Ra and try to answer them, from the nitty-gritty to more general topics. Now, since He-Man and She-Ra have a long history in comics, cartoons, and more, the answers may come from in-universe or from behind the scenes. My name is David Clark, owner of adultcollector.org, and this video's topic is... Since the original He-Man cartoon series was a big success for Mattel in filmation, and a good percentage of its viewers were girls, the idea naturally came about of creating a sister show. The setting took place on a faraway planet called Etheria, where She-Ra and the Great Rebellion fought against Hordak and the Evil Horde. One thing to differentiate She-Ra and her abilities from He-Man was her Sword of Protection. Now, He-Man's sort of power could do all kinds of things too, but that's a topic for a future video. During She-Ra's 93 episode run, her sword seemed to be capable of doing pretty much anything with a voice command from She-Ra. Power of all Etheria, come to She-Ra! And in this video, we're counting them down. Let's take a look. One thing after another. This is just not my day. Sword to shield. If I can just slow us down. Shield to parachute. for a swim. Sword to helmet. Anything that might make it drop, Joel. Sword to smoke screen. This will give us time to rescue Joel. Stand back, everybody. Sword to ice maker. Sword to lots and lots of rope. That's better. Sword to discus. Here comes another one. Sword to bola. What is this? But maybe two can. Sword to chain. I get the idea. A little teamwork is needed. Sword to glider. Got to slow us down. Every time. But I really must go. Sword to pole. Those flyers should be coming by any second now. Sword to grapple in line. Where'd she go? Now it's my turn. Sword to net. Oh. 
<laughs> you won't have me, Shira. You sound so sure of yourself. Sword to boomerang. <laughs> Boomerang to sword! Sword to handcuffs! Oh, rat! Clank! Move! They're right where I want them. In a nice straight line. Sword to bow! Bow! I need a steel arrow! One armor piercing arrow coming up! Swifty. Sword to bat. That was a hit. I can't move. Sword to lightning rod. Let's put this energy to some good use. That'll take care of Hordak's equipment. Now I've stayed out of this game long enough. Sword to blanket. This time, I win, Ninja! No, this time you lose. Time for you to join your Horde buddy. Phew, that was a lot. 
Thanks for watching. I'm David Clark. Go hit the subscribe button and let us know down in the comments if we missed anything and what you think about She-Ra's sword being able to do all these wonderful things. For the honor of Grayskull. <laughs>